Well, first and foremost, it's it's most important to prevent them from getting in the body because your body has to go through a lot of these hoops to get toxins right. in the body, right? So that is first and foremost. So making sure that you have enough fiber in the diet. When you have fiber, fiber is is incredible for binding these toxins so that they don't get absorbed by the body because once they're absorbed, now your liver has to be engaged. Your body systems have to give a little in order, and this takes a lot of energy from the body. Right. Uh, detoxification, it's an energy requiring process. So why do people get so fatigued and they can't understand why they're so fatigued? You know, they get fibromyalgia, chronic fatigue syndrome. These are syndromes of the 21st century. It's like, how did this happen? Well, one of the ways is because we've got these toxic offenders. So first and foremost, prevent them from getting in binders, binders. So what does that mean? More fiber, more psyllium, more flaxseed meal. You know, it doesn't have to be a sophisticated supplement. It can just be food, more leafy greens. Greens are great for binding the chlorophyll and greens. There are studies showing that they can bind the, the different carcinogens in food and take them out of the body. So whether it's kale, leafy greens, and it's fine to cook them, cilantro, matcha tea, green tea, think of greens to bind. So that's first and foremost. Make sure that you're pooping regularly and not rabbit pellets, but I'm talking like bulk. You want bulk. We need to be talking about that, right? And if you don't have bulk in your stool, that's telling you you need more fiber. So that's first. 